Welcome back to Let's Play Carrion. I'm Burning Dog Face, and last time we saw conclusive proof that the flesh is smarter than it looks. I would say no offense, but it would definitely eat me either way, so what's the point? That was me taking a second to remember once again that there is no map button. I'm in here now. <laughs> Hang on, there's no point to this area at all, really? I'm gonna r yank the ceiling down. about. Ahem. Surface? No. I gotta say, after learning that the, uh, the game takes place on Earth, I'm in a strange position. I've never felt ominous about the prospect of my own victory before. Oh no. Before I take a look in there. This looks like it's designed to exit to, tr to trick me into learning how these things work. Because I know that if you ram them from the other side, nothing happens. No, maybe I won't climb that ladder. Warning, this is a nuclear power plant. Unauthorized entry to this property may be construed as a threat to the safety of this facility, its workers, and the general public. Security personnel are authorized to use deadly force. Trespassers will be shot. Well, I hate that, so let me show you what I think of that. And now we know how that drains energy. It drains energy when you spear people! Oh, there's a guy with a flamethrower down there. I shouldn't fuck around with that. Touched by his noodly appendage. Here we go. Yeah, you didn't think that- oh god! No! Oh no. No energy! No! You shot your friend over there, you idiot! Wait a minute. No, I thought I could go up into that little crevice there. It's a strange day for me. Very strange. For starters, I'm starting to get recording around the time I prefer to finish recording. And that's not cool. It all started when I was looking for a double-ended USB uh, cable. And then it just kind of expanded out into a whole bunch of other stuff that needed to get taken care of. <laughs> Instant disintegration. Just drape myself over the top here. Like a stylish hat. What is this thing, anyway? I know as much about nuclear power as, uh... Well, the flesh, actually. I just wanted to cover that guy in 
whatever it is. I'm leaking everywhere. Strawberry jam. Oops. <laughs> okay, I'm almost Ah, oh, shit. I didn't know they could do that. Thought he was dead for fuck's sake. Legs for. If you can't punish them for wronging me in self defense, how. Who can you punish? God damn it, me. I didn't need that. We have a volunteer! That doesn't usually happen on this show. <laughs> oh yeah. I should mention. I want to make clear that I didn't actually know until uh, after the last session that uh, you can't actually eat these guys. See, I saw that... See, there's these red panels that turn black when they die. And I was under the impression that was like a hole. Like I just ripped the suit open and ate all the sweet goodness inside, but for some reason it's still holding a human shape. Like I left the skeleton behind. That's what I was talking about when... I've just realized that since I've got that double tentacle thing, I've actually formed two different mouths, and one of them is inside the other one. So, um... Jesus, me! And, of course, the reason for that is so you can always do this. You can't break the bodies, you can always take control. Nah. I'm not actually full. There was a body up here, wasn't there? Yes. Oh, you are alive. My bad. Like, I guess you were just playing dead. I want to leave you just with your upper half. That's just fucked up. Hello? Wait. That's a Geiger counter. I'm radioactive right now. Well, I mean, I am already a constantly mutating mass of meat, so I don't think it's going to do anything worse. I mean, honestly, if I get leukemia, I'll just break off that part and find something else to replace it. Just break off the damaged parts and keep going. Oh, I can't actually get in there. Well, then. I'll just scare the shit out of you and keep going. What's going on in there? Crystals and mold. Wait, what is with the crystals? I thought this was Earth. Between the crystals and this, actually, the pools of goo, which is totally what I was going to say there. can't push it back up. I will have to do this in a more creative way. I see. That is annoying. There's no one goddamn down there! Oh, okay, yeah. I am overthinking this. That is pretty much my problem nine times out of ten that I'm thinking too much. Actually, you know what? I have a plan. Hang on, this is a shortcut. Yes. 
Oh, that's what happened to all those guys that were down in... No, never mind. I thought it was... Where was the room full of dudes in suits? Here it is. All right, my lovelies. Guess what time it is? Maybe you just hallucinated me. Maybe I'm not real. Nah, just kidding. I'm real and there isn't going to be a Christmas this year. Not for you guys, anyway. Christ. Ah! That wasn't a background element. I just stuck my hand in a fan. God damn it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just really amused because don't stick your hand in it. We used to joke when I was a kid about, um, the, the, the weaker robot bosses on Mega Man. And, uh, my brother has always thought Air Man was really easy to beat. And he's just basically a giant fan who shoots tornadoes at you. I say giant, he's your size. You know what I mean. But, um, the joke we used to have about Air Man was, Don't stick your hand in him, Mega Man! And, uh, here I am throwing my entire body into a giant fan years later. And it wasn't even an intelligent fan that was trying to kill me. Alright, now that I am even bigger. Hi, guys. Don't mind me. I'm new here. Still trying to find my way around. <laughs> Tonight he's going to write in his journal that, that it turns out that works way better when you're in a human form. <laughs> I just imagined this thing using a pencil to write in a journal. Just blood getting everywhere. Oh yeah, that's what I figured out, yes. Get myself small again. You're goddamn right. Yes, that's exactly what that... I did not mean to push that. Whoopsie! Now they know I'm here. Do you think that was a noise that came out of a person's mouth, or did they synthesize that in the making of this game? Like that horrible guttural one there. Alright, I do need to backtrack and get those things. Oh shit, I can't backtrack. Right, okay, we'll just keep going. Just throw ourselves further down this rabbit hole. Order, shoot everything that moves! Uh, just do everything that moves and displays any signs of suspicious activity. Oh no, now it's me! That's what it was! Earlier it was shoot everything that moves and isn't human. But if... You know, oh, that guy's got a big tentacle sticking out of the back of his head. That qualifies as suspicious behavior. I wonder if those people are actually meant to be using the bathroom, you know, and they're just animating it that way because it's a video game and they don't want to draw these people pulling their pants down, or if these people are just like, I'm having a really stressful day and I'm just going to lock myself in the bathroom and have a panic attack real quick. Oh shit. No! I can't reach the damn body. Okay. Panic over. How do I let him let me in? Oops, sorry. Misfire. Bumped the controller with my hand. Ah! Ah! Do 
you get to hang out in here and be dead. Okay, yeah, I kind of have to do that, don't I? Oh no, I wanted it on this side. God damn it, I want to grab that door. And... I mean, I had to take advantage of that, but now I have to take advantage of this. The way the blood it fucking explodes everywhere is really impressive. This game would be absolutely goddamn horrifying in. Sorry, couldn't resist. It was suggested to me, by the way, that when you do that, you're not, like, sucking the juices out, as I thought, but, uh, just shaking the shit out of them and breaking all their bones so they die. A lovely thought. Um, I haven't taken any damage, so I'll just pull this. But I don't want to go up there, so I'll just do this. I knew that. That was a test. Up yours. At least the cocoons are inert by all mass. I have to assume that's why everyone wasn't immediately killed in that flashback. It does close that one. Shite. Understand what I was meant to do there. I mean, I have the shortcut now. Okay, not what I meant to do. Oh, yeah, it looks like it does start with a one mouth popping out. Okay. Okay, let me take a look. Let me take a look. Okay, if I have the shooty thing, it doesn't matter here because these blocks are in the way and they always will be. No, I need to get down there. Wish I can do that, can't I? So try going down and find out if I, where I can go up. Yeah, right here. Motherfucker, I didn't think that one through at all, did I? <laughs> Up. Through. I think I broke a toilet right there. My bad. I mean, if you kill somebody, you're just predating. If you break a toilet, that makes you a bad person. <laughs> Nobody can poop. What have I done? Really satisfying. I guess going at the skids lengthwise would do that, huh? Excuse me, real quick. I'll leave me, myself, and I down here. Uh, flesh pizza! Half an hour or it's free! <laughs> I'm just going to lock the door you guys can access real easily, and then do this. Oh, where was that power cable? 
our cable power panel. Excuse me. Because uh, I kind of want to do the cloaking thing right there. I'll tell you what, I'll find it in between this episode and the next one. Because the timer has just gone. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you next time on Let's Play Carrion. And we continue exploring this nuclear power plant and presumably make life w uh, in it worse for everyone who works here. Later!